What's up, yo? We back, guys. And if you want more Bollywood, Tywin, and Tommy movies like RR, KGF2, Beast, Master, and so much more, make sure you follow me on Instagram, at RobCDR2. DM me. Let me know what movies you guys want us to react to. We have so much Bollywood, Tywin, and Tommy movies. We want to go to over 100. So make sure you follow me on Instagram, at RobCDR2 on Instagram. On the right here, you see, is my Instagram. You follow me. Just DM me. Let me know what you guys want to watch. We got so much movies. Now let's get into this RR scene. I'll see you soon. Mars got lit another one. Yo, we back, RTTV. Gang, gang, gang. If it's your first time here, I promise you definitely won't be your last. Nah. So make sure you kill, murder, and smash. smash. That subscribe button. And today, guys, we're back with another scene from RR. We're loving this movie. And we're going to just get right into it, fellas. Wells, would you like to do the honors? Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's Kamuram Bimudo from the RR movie. Let's get it. It is Wells. I'm Mario. Let's get right into it. Where's the caption on? Oh, this where they gonna violate my boy. Damn. Violation. Say it ain't so. Complete devastation. Just to see you now, I was kind of dreading to see because I know I was gonna get me hated. And the music video was crazy. Yeah, so imagine like the, the actual movie sequence of it. Look, it's hurting him. Yeah, because it's like no hard feelings, but these feelings hard. Nah, he's a dickhead, bro. He's really an asshole, bro. Like, that's grimy, bro. Like, I don't know how you could forgive a nigga like that, bro. Like, yeah. even if he, like, says, I'm go back on your side, it's like, I don't know, bro. But he's, and he's crazy the because... We got last time, right? That made him kind of, like, make sure that he carries out this... That mission. Yeah, yeah but I feel like it's a grudge that he's held. I feel like it's a grudge that he's holding. This and he doesn't, yeah. This guy that has like, That's what I'm saying. I think that at, at a point in time, get over your grudge, bro. Nah, but I feel like I, what if it's it, not what that, if simple, that, but that why grudge is what made that? you a cop? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like the very reason I'm a cop is because of this, th this thing that happened to me in the past. So your friend has to suffer. I mean, I just oh, met this God. nigga. <laughs> Honestly. I mean, yeah. I mean, in all reality, we don't know how long it's been since they've met. Yeah. That's still long. Well, actually, we don't. Actually, we don't know that. We don't. They want to beg for his life. Basically, apologize or get whipped. Man, fuck you. He's like, I'm not no Even bitch. Him, bro. He's going to be the one to do nah, it. That's nah, crazy. Nah. That's what I'm saying. I can't fuck with this nigga. <laughs> nah, nigga. One here, I'm good, nigga. Yeah. Like, fuck this nigga, bro. He nah, that's fuck crazy. that nigga, bro. And the other dude did it intentionally. Nigga, you treat me like a slave, bro? Nah, I'm going to beat your ass, bro. I don't know, nigga. Nah, this is OD, bro. But yeah. still, even as a cop, how could you watch these people do this to... Like, why are you doing this? Stop, other, nigga. To other Indians and be okay with it, regardless of what the grudge is. Shut oh. oh, hell no. Oh my yeah. god, bro. I can't defend this nigga no more. You can't. Yeah. He's doing this in front of I don't know. Now I just don't like seeing He's doing this in front of I feel like I got PTSD from He's doing this in front of his own people, bro. Yeah, hell yeah. Dude's crazy. I can't I hate watching this type of thing, bro. Yeah, this this like, is wow. Sick, he's a, he's a sick piece of shit. Look at She's this. sick. Wow, see, he was satisfied, but she's not. Yeah. And he pulled his chain so he can fall. You seen that? He tried to save him. Hey, oh, she a bitch. 
That lady right there, you can tell she is not liking us at all, yo. I hope she gets bodied. Wait, wh- why they want him to kneel for? Because they want him to beg for his life. Kneel before the crown, too. Yeah. But you submitted to the... Whatever the rule is. Oh! oh yeah. I can't watch How that. did she just have that in the stash? Like, that's, how sick, that's how sick she is, bro. What the fuck? It's like, you know you racist if you keep a whip on you. Nah, 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 no, nah, you're just nah, a different nah, type nah, of crazy nah, if you just nah, have a whip. Nah, 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 nah. Did, we see, this? Did we see that whip in the music video? Uh, yeah, I think I, he already I, was using it at that point. Remember, like, it, it lashed on, he pulled it. Nah, yeah, I do remember. Oh, I can't see this, though. That reminds me of Passion of Christ. Oh. Nah, see, this is the moment I got to quit, bro. Nah, I can't see this. I have no respect for this guy. Oh. This is what I did to Wood. Oh, this is horrible, bro. Are y'all kneeling or what? Yeah. yeah. If I'm that down for the bro, ball, yeah. No, I'm not. Nah, I'm kneeling, nigga. I'm kneeling, bro. I have PTSD. Uh, bro, from, uh, bro, I'm telling you right now, I can never been a slave, they bro. They just took out a shit with all the nails. Yo, Pat, that's the what, most painful thing that they could possibly do to you is hit you with a whip with nails. Oh, yeah. I, I don't know, bro. I don't know what else could be more. I said if I'm, da- I'm down for the ball. Man, I don't know from being, I have PTSD, bro. I'm good. Oh, the wind. I got, like, ancestry PTSD, bro. This is the music video we saw, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep, I remember this. Now I understand this scene more now. This is the only way I could watch this scene where he has to be singing, nigga. Like, imagine if he was a singer and he just got yeah. hit. Yeah, no sound in the background. Yeah, it would have been OD, bro. Yeah, that's true. Like, that scene was going to be way too graphic, bro, like, for me. It's crazy, though, because they trained. Oh! Oh! Nah, Rob, you're actually right. If he wasn't singing, yeah, bro, it would've would've been been too... even more painful. Oh, fuck. Yeah, like, you see how it's making, like, it, the way it looked before was it looked way too crazy, bro. Like, I think it looks strong as shit singing like it ain't hurt yeah. him. Oh, he's not nailing he's it coming show that he's strong. Fame. Like, yo, yeah. you, ain't, you wasn't born one of us, bro. You wasn't born one of us. And that's why he can't nail, bro. It's not even just for him. It's for his people. It's Yo, like their friendship, like I, this is the worst friendship I've ever. Like I never want him to be cool with that dude, bro. bro. They're not cool. Like you, how you not know that you like what your boy does for a living? Yeah. The whole time. There's nobody I've been chill with that I don't know what they do. <laughs> but it's like, and also if he, they're already oh lowering the morale, gosh. the morale. Oh. They're lowering the morale of the people by beating him. So if he kneels, that's just gonna lower it even more. You gotta stay strong for his people. No, I'm not kneeling, bro. I'm not kneeling. Oh, what he's doing is even worse. Wow, shit. Nah, he's a bitch, bro. Oh, my God. You see the see nails all red? Tremble with fear at the mere sight of blood, nigga. Come on, nah, no, it's not me. Yeah, you ain't, you he's know like, You can't forest. break me. Oh, they stretch them all, right? Jesus Christ. Eesh. This is tough to watch. I feel ah. like... The fact that this actually been done to people would blows my mind, dude. There's a puddle shoe on it. I feel like... I feel like this is some shit like, yo, he's like, yo, you think you believe what you believe in a lot? Look at what I'm going through for my shit. (laughs) 
explicit perception of blood as if like it's something holy. So it's like you may look at it and say, oh, you got me bleeding and I'm defeated, but I look at it as something that's actually pure and a blessing. Yeah, this is a sacrifice. They're gonna be mad. Look at it. You only just made everybody matter. Oh, he still, he still won't didn't fall. Kneel. He still won't fall. Oh. Imagine. Yeah, I got chills right there. I ain't gonna lie. Imagine seeing the dude. He did all that not to fall and then finally fall, bro. You're gonna you're gonna revolt just like them. Yeah. He set this whole shit off. Oh now you wanna now you wanna check on me? Get the hell out of here, bro. Get the nigga, hell out of here, that bro. To me, nigga. That nigga is crazy, bro. Now nah, I ain't gonna lie, this movie's very powerful. Yeah. The storyline is crazy. Oh, oh I ain't gonna lie, yo, but it, that man. is this the first movie that we've seen racism like this, though? Um, I don't think any movie this, really, this like, genre, to this extent, yeah, I don't like, think with so. British and, like, yeah. colonizing all that. I gotta say, this based on a, a true story or something? Considering the time period, I think something like this could happen. Yeah, that we yeah. seen like colonization and like real racism yeah, at this extent. The other, like, other like they, they have watch. suppressing this stuff, but it's like more of their people. This is like exactly. it's like another country. Exactly. I mean, like so we seen that like with the government was like violating the people, getting away with everything, but this is different. I wanted to finish that movie. I need to see. I need to see what's gonna happen right now. Cause honestly, man, fuck yo, that's crazy, bro. I'm leaving something that crazy, man, and they do that to you. That that Trash. scene. I'm so happy that we watched that scene in, in its full context. Well, kind of in its full context of um the music video because we seen the music video. The music video came on before the movie, and seeing that scene, it was crazy, you know. But like the music video, it like. It was preparing for what happened, but seeing how it took place and like how he had the first whip and how he didn't want to kneel, and then she threw the other whip in, and like I was, like I was um, saying earlier, I like how they made it. Um, they wanted to show how graphic it is, but they still made it where you could uh, tolerate it because I feel like the music video was really needed for that scene because if it wasn't, to me that would have been equivalent to like uh, Passion of the Christ or like that type of, of slavery or like even um like Kuta Kente, like I just feel like I'm not a fan. Oof. I just don't like whips, yo. I don't know. And then seeing nails on a whip and then like I don't know. And then people like all that extra stuff. I mean it's just like so I'm happy they did that because I really was gonna close my eyes if that scene I was like on everything I love I wasn't gonna watch that scene. Yeah. I like how they don't hold back too because I feel like this is a topic that like you can't hold back on because it happened like in so many different countries and stuff. So it's like I like how they put such a big budget behind a movie like this. And like out of all, I'm gonna say out of a lot of movies that I've seen that has music in it and music videos, this one played in and transitioned like one of the best to me. And it felt like in my in real life that could have happened. Like if you if somebody was getting tortured, actually no, it does happen in real life because I remember slavery. Like they had the songs that they sang. And that to get them through those depressive and like abusive moments, so I could, I, it felt mad realistic having them like sing at this nigga like, oh, like nigga, yo, you ain't gonna break me, bro. Yo, watching this scene definitely makes you cringe because, regardless of whatever grudge that this guy may be holding because of what happened to, I don't know if that was a family member or whoever it was that had died. Regardless of what grudge that he may be holding, it's still you're still siding with the oppressors and they're kind of making you look crazy because they're doing this to add salt to the wound they're doing it to add salt to the wound and you're seeing it be done you're seeing it be done and it's almost as if you're okay with it because you can't get over whatever grudge that you're having Not almost. He like okay with it. like like 
he can't. And I think that at a certain point in time, you just have to look at the grand scheme of things. He has to look at the grand scheme of things in the bigger picture and realize, listen, whatever grudge that I've had, it's not even worth what I'm doing. Because yeah. it's not. It's not. Yeah, I really like the fact that the cop looks like towards the end he went to go touch the pool of blood and, and uh, homie was singing about that, how, uh, how like we were talking about when we was watching the video. Um, I feel like uh, they chose the wrong person to do this to. Like the very thing that was trying to discourage the people to rebel mm -hmm. ended up being the one thing that the encouraged them to. You know what I'm saying? So like I feel like um, the, the strongest... Uh, the oppressor's strongest soldier is going to be the biggest weakness now because I feel like he's going to be the person to turn and uh, be ignite the rebellion now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? To, like me, it's, to huh? me, my fault. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt. No, what were you going to say? I was going to say, to me, it's already too late. If I'm them, it's like, don't switch sides. Keep the same energy, bro. I mean, if it, if it helps, it helps. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He, he's a person from within. I feel I feel you on that. It's going to take yeah. a I feel like it will be, he's not going to gather people up and be like, this is what we're going to do. I think mm -hmm. he's just going to do something on his own. This movie was amazing, guys. And um, good news for you guys. We have this scene today, and then we missed a scene, a uh, couple scenes back, the RR Jenny romantic scene. So we got today's scene and tomorrow's scene. And then this Thursday, guys, 10 a.m. Pacific time, we'll be watching this movie live. So don't worry, Evan. There's at least an hour and 30 minutes we haven't seen. Okay. And we got that left this Thursday. 10 p.m. Pacific, 8, 10 a.m. Pacific time. The information will be in this video, guys. So make sure you pull up to the live. You can watch this whole entire movie with us live. Comment on Twitch at RTTV5. All the information will be in this video. So make sure you keep it locked. And if it's your first time here, I promise you definitely won't be your last. Nah. So make sure you kill, murder, and smash. smash. That subscribe button. I go by the name of Rob RT. You can check out our Bollywood, our Tyler, and our Tommy playlist. Link in the description below. I'm that Bollywood guy, that Tollywood guy, that Tom Man guy. Yo, that's the music guy. Check out all our musical playlists. Shout out to all my Haitians. Shout out to India. Sock passe na boule pie. I say compé. It's a man, the myth, the maniac. Wilkins underscore RT. It's your boy Wellsy Anime King. It's your boy DC. And that settles it at the, the round table. table.